Hi, I'm Sherry Stump. Thank you for joining me today. I'm reading from the devotional book, God's Amazing Grace by Ellen White. Today's reading is September 13 on page 264. The title of today's devotion is Points Out the Way. In Jeremiah chapter 42 and verse 3, it says, that the Lord thy God may show us the way wherein we may walk and the thing that we may do. To dwell upon the beauty, goodness, mercy, and love of Jesus is strengthening to the mental and moral powers. And while the mind is kept trained to do the works of Christ, to be obedient children, you will habitually inquire, is this the way of the Lord? Will Jesus be pleased to have me do this? Many need to make a decided change in the tenor of their thoughts and actions if they would please Jesus. We can seldom see our sins in the grievous light that God can. Many have habituated themselves to pursue a course of sin and their hearts harden under the influence of the power of Satan. But when in the strength and grace of God, they place their minds against the temptations of Satan. Their minds are made clear, their hearts and consciences, by being influenced by the Spirit of God, are made sensitive, and then sin appears as it is, exceedingly sinful. Every act of obedience to Christ, every act of self-denial for His sake, every trial well endured, Every victory gained over temptation is a step in the march to the glory of final victory. If we take Christ for our guide, he will lead us safely. The various sinner need not miss his way. Not one trembling seeker need fail of walking in pure and holy light. Though the path is so narrow, so holy that sin cannot be tolerated therein, Yet access has been secured for all, and not one doubting, trembling soul need say, God cares not for me. And all the way up the steep road leading to eternal life are wellsprings of joy to refresh the weary. Those who walk in wisdom's ways are even in tribulation exceeding joyful. For he whom their soul loveth walks invisible beside them. At each upward step, they discern more distinctly the touch of his hand. At every step, brighter gleamings of glory from the unseen fall upon their path, and their songs of praise, reaching ever a higher note, ascend to join the songs of angels before the throne. The path of the righteous is as the light of dawn that shineth more and more unto the perfect day. Proverbs 4.18, Revised Version. Thank you for being with me today. Please join me tomorrow when we will read about For Him Who Believes. And may God bless you abundantly above all you can ask or think.